Here's Julie getting ready to go. Alright, so I have to consider the parallax. So I, I mean, I know a lot about this stuff because I used to fly lighter. Parallax is yeah. the Alright, Doherty slide. It's uh, late in the evening, or about 5.30 or so, I would guess. And there she is. She's soaring. She had a good launch. Well, it seemed like sort of like conditions, but she's definitely buoyant. And she's above launch. Uh-oh, she's sinking out a little bit, but hopefully she'll get back up as she comes this way. Here we are on the desert floor below Doherty Slide. Launch is up there somewhere. She really had a good flight, but eventually the lift petered out. And she had to come down here and land in the desert, right about here. And in the dirt. Yeah, in the dirt, in the sagebrush. Here she is now. Hi. <laughs> here we are, all picked up. It sure is desolate country out here, but pretty in its own way. Here we are at the burn. There's Julie circling above. I just top landed after about an hour. It's a pretty nice evening. Here she comes getting ready for top landing. Coming on final. Got some speed. <laughs> All right, good one, babe. Hey, get this Here we are on top of the burn, October 17th. A late fall flight, smoke in the valley. Here's Julie. Bruce is here also. <gasps> All right. <laughs> All right. Anyway, here we are. It's back from launch. We report well, to launch conditions. Yeah, like um, five to ten miles per hour. We're crossing the south. All right. Degrees cross. We're now recorded for posterity. Yes. Is it really 343? Go no, it couldn't be 343. It's, a great sink rate. it's only 143. 244. 240 five, for six. 243. Okay, we're an hour off on the time here. Here we are walking the launch. Ralph is going to be the brave one. It's just so smoky. They've been doing control burns. Here we have Bruce coming down to launch. <laughs> He's laughing. Here we have Bruce getting ready to go. Good launch. Yeah, he's flapping that harness.
Here's Ralph coming in for a top landing. He's really close. Seems like he's too far. Too close. Let's get it back a little. Flying over hunters. He's flying right into the sun. It's really hard to keep track of him. Not this again. <laughs> that was a little scary. My setup was wasn't quite what I planned, but it was okay. See, he came kind of close to the uh -huh. fence. I'm just putting it to perspective here. <laughs> but I saved my instruments. He likes to land close to the camera. How did it look to you? Close. I was hoping I would make that last turn, come up this way. At Rainbow, on a very, very chilly day. He's setting up. All bundled up. Have a few hardy pilots that have already flown. There's the brave Julie hooking in. The time on that previous flight was an hour off. It's actually 2.37 at this point, as you can see. And, I'd like uh, to do a hang check because my parachute's been repacked. Okay. I seem to be out of film. There she goes. Good launch. Horse Canyon in uh, San Diego. Julie's getting ready for a flight. And. Good one! Canyon. I'll 
show you where we're camping. Looks all blurry down there. There's the LZ right there. And we're camping way out on that lake over there. Here we are in the LZ. Julie says she had a good landing. How was it, babe? Trashy little LZ. Uh-huh. I want to check my rib. I it. But you had a good one? Yeah, it was okay. I, I was getting turned a lot. Had to do a lot of corrections, and then I flared. Probably got a little early, but... Um, Better early. I caught my swing tip. Oh. Looks fairly big from down here, but from the sky, it looks pretty tiny. Good. Ralph is moving up to launch. We have behind him Dan walking up. Low. It's not real low. Still the tent. He got up above launch. And it's not real buoyant like it was yesterday. He's working it. Thing's a floater, huh? Yeah. Man, he just floated off. <laughs> I want one. There we had Dan just launch. Looks like a good launch. Here we have Ralph moving up to launch at Horse Canyon. He's going to be the pilot for the day here. All the other pilots have gone to Big Black. It's northwest wind today. And he's going to risk a crosswind launch. There's the tail tails. There. There he is. Got off safe. Well, that's really ripping in. Well above launch. Here we are in our camp. at Lake Marina. And there's Polly. She spotted some gophers. She's getting ready to spring. She's got herself some gophers all lined up. See those fresh piles over there? 
are on Super Bowl Sunday at our little camp at Lake Marina. We just come back for a walk in midday. And this is a pretty little park. It's about 75 degrees right now. Here's our camp. With Julie. Getting things ready. Our motor home. The trooper. The camp's practically empty. Everybody's back home watching the Super Bowl. And I didn't even see her. But there's our Polly. She's been having a great time here. Checking out all the gophers. Hi, Polly. Hey, baby. Okay, here we are again. At our little home. Let's go for an inside look. <laughs> My beautiful wife. Here's the upstairs bedroom. All the seaweed bags are stowed. There's the bathroom door. And back into the spacious expanse. And here's their spacious bathroom. And shower. north along the ridge. I see uh, seas out there. We are at the setup area from Mount Laguna. And there's Ralph. And there's the Cnet Lounge. Here we are, back at Horse Canyon, later in the afternoon. Julie's going to take a flight. Uh, conditions are slightly better than they were this morning. I've been pretty tired today, so I'm going to drive. Anyway, it's almost 3 o'clock and she's getting ready to launch. Good one! Getting pretty hazy. Back in our camp, and Julie's out doing her exercises on the table. Polly's up in the tree getting hassled by the crows. She was up in the tree and she got down without us seeing her. You do that in a double surface and it would hurt, huh? And here we have Tom coming in.
be followed shortly by Ralph. He was right there. This could be interesting. Hi, Tom. <laughs> How do you like hang gliding so far? <laughs> okay, here's Bill coming in. He just did some wing overs, now he's getting low. I left my heart in San Francisco, so I'm going to say. Making a set up. We may run out of film. Yeah, On the last minute of film, but here he comes. Bill Kimball just did his landing. Here's six, we're getting ready to leave the leave our campground. And we're all packed up and ready to go. And it's uh because there's a rainstorm coming in. Here's our friend Mortimer, the duck, who we've been feeding. Mortimer's a cute guy. Very friendly guy. Yeah, he's a Muskegon duck. And he's very cute. Yeah, here comes Julie to feed him another piece of bread. He's full. Okay. He's already had a loaf. Okay. He's afraid I'm going to catch him. Yeah. He's afraid I'm going to catch him. Because you picked He's him up and hugged him. He's afraid I'm going to catch him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Put him down the road. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. He scared him. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's Let's fun. Do a ducky. Yeah. yeah, a piece of bread for all your efforts. Yeah. Yep. Time to go. Here we are back in Yuma, back on Mom and Bill's lot. There's their motor home over there. Trooper, this whole neighborhood is a bunch of RV lots. And here's the storm we fled from. Looks like it's following us over. We are February 12th. We're back at the campground at Lake Marina.
Here's Polly taking a bath upstairs. And we have a beautiful sight this time. Looking out on the lake. See if we can see it from here. Oops. Anyway, there's beautiful Lake Marina. There's Julie doing her exercises. What other friend I forgot to tell you about? Our friend Mortimer's back. There's Mortimer waiting for some handouts. And he and Polly have been getting along a little better now. Anyway, that's Mortimer. Well, it's Friday the 13th. Before the big weekend, the park's been filling up. Here's Polly. And here's her friend Mortimer. Sitting on the fence. They get within two or three feet of each other now. And, as I said, the park is filling up. Lots of kids. Lots of motorhomes. But, there's a storm coming in, too. Getting gas in Tonopah. This is the scenery around here. <laughs> Never a dull moment. Yes, sir. Things are happening. Here's the town of Tonopah. Shark lighters. There's some hot rod, and it's way too cold to get out there.